So let's graph the linear equation for y equals 8x plus 1. We're going to use a table of values. You could use a slope intercept form, and there's a link at the end of the video if you need to know how to do that. But we're going to use table of values here. So we put values in for x, and then we find out what y equals, and we plot it. It's always good to start out with 0, because 8 times 0, that's just 0. 0 plus 1, that's 1. And I'm just making these numbers up, but I want them to fit on my graph. So I could say just 1, 8 times 1, that's 8. 8 plus 1 is 9. That should work. That should fit. And then how about, let's do negative 1. Because if I do 2, I get 16. I get y equals 17. That's not going to work on my graph. So we're going to do negative 1. 8 times negative 1 is negative 8 plus 1, negative 7. So now we have our points. We can graph for the linear equation y equals 8x plus 1. So we come over here, and we're going to graph x is 0, y is 1. x is 0, y is 1. That's our first point. x is 1, y is 9. So x is 1, and y is way up here, 9. And then our last point, x is negative 1, y is negative 7. And you can see they all line up. Let's put a line through that. Then we'll put arrows on the ends, show it goes to infinity. That's the line for y equals 8x plus 1. You could put other values in for x. They would give you values for y. Then you plot it. They'd be on the line here. This is Dr. B. Thanks for watching.